Well, these paper cups, billions of these paper cups are chucked away every day. But you can make an extremely nice spinning propeller from these paper cups. And what we need to make this cup propeller is a couple of paper cups, a CD, cycle spoke, some glue and a half press button. First take this CD and put the rubber foam on top of it. Stick it with the glue. Make a hole in the middle of this foam and stick a cycle spoke in the hole. Now take one of the paper cups and stick a half press button inside the paper cup. Now take another paper cup and join these two paper cups back to back. The paper cup which doesn't have the button will become the propeller. After sticking, cut the paper cup without the press button in 10 to 15 petals by making 10 to 15 cuts on the side of the cup. These petals will make the fans of the propeller. And now press the paper cup on the table and these blades will stick out. You can also decorate your fan with plastic tape. Now stick two pieces of tape making a plus sign with a hole on the middle on the other paper cup. Remember to turn all the fan blades in one direction. The propeller is almost ready. Now insert the spoke through the hole in the tape so that it rests on the press button. Since this is a metal to metal junction, there will be very little friction and the propeller will spin freely. See how we have converted our trash, which we usually dump into a wonderful spinning propeller. If we attach a coil and a magnet, we might also be able to produce electricity. So enjoy making this propeller. See how children are having fun with it. Well, hope you enjoyed making this spin propeller and now it's time to think. Now, in this case, we have cut 15 petals. Now measure the angle between two consecutive petals. Instead of these 15 petals, suppose you were to just cut 10 petals and measure the angle again. Now what is the relationship between the number of petals and the angle in between? Send your responses at support at arvindguptatoys.com and you can also send your feedback on our Facebook.